Willie D. Live. You know, and we we cut from the same cloth, but you know, you your approach may be a little different sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, uh, I do what I can on a small budget. <laughs> Man, how, how how much of this game do you want? Like, how much of it do you want? Like, right now, you you're doing good for yourself. Yeah. You know, you got some of the top fighters in the game. Yeah. You know, like you got one of the greatest prospects, with Shakur Stevenson. Yeah. You know, as far as like, not, well, not just really a prospect; he's already a champion. Yeah. But I'm talking about as far as prospect for 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 Hall of Fame. You know, uh, how much of this game do you want? I, I would I would tell you, I promoted my first fight back in 1999, and 89. I'm sorry, in the 89, and I would say. I've been in the game about 34 years as a promoter. I started out managing first. I had a little kid named Donna Sugar Ray Capers. Boy, he was like a Sugar Ray Leonard. But at that time, you know, we didn't get to where. I lost him to Don King. That's how I first met Don King. We beat one of his top fighters. Mm -hmm. And next thing you know, they got him from me. But it was a learning style. But I would say right now, with the, with the, Fighters that I have now, I'm not into, I don't need other fighters. You know, Shakur, Shakur is is six years into a pro. And Floyd boxing for 20 years. I would give, you know, different times in different eras now. 15 years would still be good for a kid like Shakur, and he'll be dominant at it. Could do it 20 years because, he, you know, he live boxing in his style. style. Yeah. But, you know, 15 years from now, I'm going to be 75 years old. You understand what I'm saying? So I, I can still do it because Bob Aaron, the guy that runs Top Rank that I do most mm -hmm. of my business with, which pretty much all my business with because he have an exclusive deal with ESPN. So I do, we do like 31 fights a year on ESPN and it's unlimited on ESPN Plus, depending if they want to pick it up. So I would, he 92 years old, and he's still at every fight. Mm -hmm. But I would tell you that me, myself, I, 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 could, I could walk away from boxing right now, but I wouldn't walk away from the young guys. It's just more than being a promoter to them. I'm, I'm, I'm like a, I consider myself like a big brother, a big uncle, a big father, whatever. I was going to beat me to the punch again. Yeah. No pun intended. Yeah. But... I was about to say, you haven't walked away from the game, or you're, you're not going to walk away from the game anytime soon because you feel a sense of commitment. Correct. If If you did walk away and one of the guys said, Tony, but I need you, man. I need you. I, I, damn, I don't really want to, but I, I'll do it for you, man. I, I'll come on back. You know what I'm saying? Like if one of them guys call you or Jay call and say, come on, Tony, man, let's, let me, let's, let's just get a few more under yeah, our belt, man. Let's happen. get a few more, man. Well, we, just, we need to do this together. Yeah. Stuff means stuff to me, like you, with you. Just early this morning, I was doing an ESPN here, shooting three days for Jared Allison, big baby, because yeah. he fight July the 1st. This morning, we were shooting a scene at 9 o'clock. Today, he's at the gym, and he had to be there for 1 o'clock. But to me, you know, I gave my word, and you— you like family to me. You know, I knew you before I knew any of these guys. I, I kept it real. I said, look here, I'm going to do this show with Willie D. I, you know, I did this and done that. I don't have to be there, but I would be there because that's what I do. But at the main same time, this is important for me to come on your show. You invited me on here, and I had to do it. He's had the same time I had to be here is the same time he spawned there. Right. And But I told him, I said, look, I'm going to do what it is. And, and, and that's what it is. And what I told you about ESPN. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to know what you told him about. You know, I get checks for uh, working with ESPN, so I ain't going to repeat it. <laughs> but, you know, uh, but, you know, but I, but I appreciate that, man, because, yeah. you know, you know, to me, loyalty is everything. It means everything. And yeah. this is still the same. Yeah. You know, we talking about boxing. We talking about, you know, I came and do your show, but at the end of the day, day is to help do what I'm doing in boxing, you know what I'm saying? Because 
most of the stuff we talking about is real life and it's still about boxing and yeah. all the friendship that in years that we done went through. So it all works both ways, you know what I'm saying? So I'm not there to spawn, but look what we're doing. Everybody going to see this. Everybody going to know about July the 1st that if right. I wasn't on this show, there's people that watch Willie D's show that don't even watch boxing. Man, we talking about all yeah. these great fights that they didn't know your background is boxing too. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You really, really love boxing and you know boxing. You were good. You're great at music, but boxing is something you could have done. Yeah. <laughs> you know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. 